Hiya. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Lavish V here and a big thank you to each and every one of my subscribers. You are awesome, awesome, awesome. For those of you who are new to my channel, what I do here, it is some hair, fashion, makeup, beauty, vlogging, and a lot of perfume reviews. Yes, if you haven't already subscribed, come on, you know what to do. Please hit the subscription button along with the notification bell. Please do watch my videos and do leave me some thumbs up. And guys, girls, women, men, please don't forget to comment in my comment section as I am so enjoying the interaction with all of you guys. So yes, please do keep your comments coming. So guys, without further ado, let's jump right into today's fragrance review. And the fragrance that I'm going to be reviewing now, it is the Yugo Boss Woman. And let's just have a look at the bottle and i haven't got the cap for this one anymore guys so that's the bottle there for you and yes the cap normally clip here and clip around there but i'm gonna put the notes on the screen here for you and once um i'm gonna get a photo as well of the actual bottle with the cap and it will be on the notes that's in this fragrance so you will be able to see what the bottle fully looks like from um, that photo but for now it is a simplistic looking bottle and we are gonna um, be discussing it so I'm gonna spray my test strip guys and I'm also going to Spray a little in the atmosphere and then let us discuss this Yugo Boss Woman. So, spray my test strip and let's get the atmosphere smelling good. So guys, I'm not gonna lie to you when I'm gonna say that this Yugo Boss Woman it smells fresh and very casual and the freshness it sort of reminds me of um some of the Dana Karen fragrances the DKNY um delicious version has come up with a similar scent the ones that's very casual scent and what you get from this one it is some apples and some jasmine and some lily type of smell that's popping in the atmosphere and and a little bit of a mustiness and that is what i smell radiating around but it is fresh and a little bit green and you can't hide away from that and it gets this um kind of casual work um everyday scent that's what this one pops right from the get-go so i'm gonna um go ahead and smell my test strip and then let's discuss it a little bit more and see if it develop into something more from my test strip so let us give it a go okay on my test strip again it is the same you get this um apple peach and fruity floral citrusy mossy um jasmine orchidy vanilla sweetness it's got an essence of vanilla and maybe amber so with this um yoga boss woman i'm not getting any alluringness from the scent it's not intoxicating and it's not sophisticated enough it is just casual and and blase blase i'm not gonna fight for this bottle y'all it's not giving me any wow factor but it's not a bad scent it's a everyday and it's also 
not offensive. It's it's got some freshness to the fragrance and and some woodiness and uh, it's coming up now and a powdery vibe as well. So it's very cooling and I would call this an aquatic scent. Yes. So with this um Yuga Boss woman, let me sum it up for you. This is a casual um daytime maybe uh work scent you could wear this to work because it's inoffensive and um and and okay for work or everyday wear casual casual um affair and it has a I will call this a fruit a pot, a little sweet fruity floral woody musky um powdery scent um aquatic and green and that is what I would give to this um Yugo boss woman um casual and I could live without it it's nothing special but it's not um a horrible scent but um it's not like whoa it doesn't wow me so yeah that's what I have to say about this one and that's it for my review of you go boss woman so look after yourselves and until next time take care bye